Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. This is me Faraz Gurban Rajpar and in this video lecture I am going to discuss with you about the basic medicinal chemistry of benzodiazepine. In this video lecture I will share you some important basic facts and important tricks which will help you in understanding the chemical structure of complex benzodiazepine. So at the end of this lecture, I am quite hopeful that you will be able to draw the complex chemical structure of benzodiazepine. So let's start this video lecture. Benzodiazepine. Benzodiazepine are named so because the chemical structure of benzodiazepine contain the two important ring. One is the aromatic ring that is the benzene ring. The benzene ring is fused with seven membered heterocyclic ring that is the diazepine ring that's why they are named as benzodiazepine these are the two different rings. this is the benzene ring this is the diazepine ring these both rings are basically fused with one another so diazepine ring apart from benzodiazepine is a heterocyclic ring that contain two nitrogen atom as a heteroatom and it has the unsaturation in entire seven member heterocyclic ring at alternate position but in case of benzodiazepine you may observe that the unsaturation is present only between the fourth and fifth position of the ring and the nitrogen atom is present at the first and fourth position and that's why this type of diazepine ring is known as the 1,4 diazepine. So this 1,4 diazepine ring is fused with the benzene ring in case of benzodiazepine. Beside this, the di is a part in the benzodiazepine to represent the presence of the two nitrogen atom in the diazepine ring. The numbering of benzodiazepine ring starts from this nitrogen, which is nearer to the benzene ring so basically these both rings are fused together and numbering will start from this nitrogen this is the first position second third fourth and fifth at this fifth position you may observe in the upcoming slides that uh, there will be the presence of phenyl group that is also the important structural feature of all the benzodiazepine okay so this will entire become the uh, ring nucleus for the benzodiazepine Okay, the unsaturation is present is only between the fourth and fifth carbon atom. So now let's learn about the ring nucleus of the benzodiazepine. Now let's learn how to draw the chemical structure of different benzodiazepine. For that, you have to remember some basic facts in your mind. Basically, benzodiazepine contain the three rings. Two rings are benzene ring and one is the diazepine ring like this one this is the benzene ring and this benzene ring is combined or fused with this seven member heterocyclic diazepine ring okay at the fifth position you may find the presence of aryl or phenyl ring this is the first position this is the second third fourth and fifth Okay, so in all the benzodiazepine, the fifth position of the diazepine ring contain an other benzene ring or phenyl ring. So benzodiazepine, that's why are termed as the 5-aryl-1,4 benzodiazepine. The next important fact is the second position. The second number position or second number carbon atom of most of benzodiazepine contain the ketone group that is the carbonyl group okay so when we will check the structure of most of benzodiazepine at this second number position you will find the presence of carbonyl group except the chlorodiazepoxide and the cuazepam in these chlorodiazepoxide and cuazepam the carbonyl or ketone group will be absent but in case of cuazepam at the second position sulfur group will be present 
and the chloride is epoxide will contain the methyl amine group the an other important fact about the benzodiazepine structure is at the third position at this position you may find the presence or absence of hydroxyl group so in some benzodiazepine will have the hydroxyl group at this position and some may have not the other important point is the seventh number carbon atom or the seventh position all the benzodiazepine contain a electronegative atom at the seventh position that is the halogen atom so mostly they contain the chlorine and some contain the nitro group at this position like in case of nitrazepam and clonazepam have the nitro group at the seventh position so to make uh, this structure simpler you have to keep in mind that first you have to draw the benzene ring okay then draw the diazepine ring that is fused with the benzene ring and at the fifth position you have to draw an other benzene ring okay after that depending on the type of benzodiazepine you will have to keep the different functional group at the position like in all other benzodiazepine the common group at the second position will be the carbonyl or ketone group except the chloride epoxide and quazepa and at third position some have the hydroxyl group and some may have the not hydroxyl group and an other important point is the presence of unsaturated double bond between the fourth and fifth position three hydroxy benzodiazepine and those without the three hydroxy benzodiazepine some benzodiazepine have the hydroxyl group at the third position the presence of this hydroxyl group enhances the polar characteristic of the benzodiazepine and due to this they are already polar in nature and they can directly undergo through the conjugation during the metabolism okay conjugate and they will form conjugate with the glucuronic acid and glucuronide that's why they have the shorter half life the example of benzodiazepine which have the hydroxyl group at their third position are the oxazepam lorazepam and temazepam so the key points are the trick to draw the structure of these oxazepam lorazepam and q temazepam is first you have to draw the basic ring nucleus of the benzodiazepine that is the two benzene ring and one diazepine ring okay and then you have to place the carbonyl group at the second number position and at third position the important is the presence of the hydroxyl group and at the seventh position you have to place the chlorine atom okay so the next is the without three hydroxyl group these are the benzodiazepine which do not have any substitution at the third position means they do not have the hydroxyl group at the third position this makes them the nonpolar okay so they can first have to undergo through the oxidation or phase 1 metabolism and during phase 1 metabolism they will first undergo oxidation and during oxidation hydroxyl group is introduced in their chemical structure which increases their polar characteristic and then they can undergo through the conjugation to form the glucuronide so these benzodiazepine have longer half life in comparison to those with the three hydroxyl group the example of without three hydroxy group benzodiazepine are the diazepam chlorazepate chlorazepoxide nitrazepam clonazepam and florazepam so you have to keep in mind the date all these benzodiazepine like diazepam chlorazepate chlorazepoxide nitrazepam and so on these all have no any substitution at the third position means they lack the hydroxyl group at the third position now 
This is the chemical structure of chlorodiazepoxide. Chlorodiazepoxide is known to be the first ever benzodiazepine to be discovered. Chlorodiazepoxide is termed as the 2-methylamine benzodiazepine. Basically, at the second number position, it contains the methylamine group. Okay, we have already discussed that there are some benzodiazepines which like the ketone group at second position. This is one example is the chlorodiazepoxide. Chlorodiazepoxide contain the methyl amino group at the second number position. And beside this, it also have the unsaturation between the one and two carbon. This characteristic is also different from all other benzodiazepine. The third structural feature of the chlorodiazepoxide that it contain the oxide ion at the fourth position. Okay, apart from this, all other structural features are similar to the benzodiazepine. Like uh, it has the phenyl ring at the fifth position and uh, chlorine at the seventh position. All these structural features are similar to other benzodiazepine. So, the, for chlorodiazepoxide, you have to keep in mind that at second position, you have to place methyl amino group and unsaturation at first and second and fourth and fifth position and besides it oxide at the fourth number nitrogen atom diazepone chlorodiazepoxide is basically the first ever benzodiazepine to be discovered all other all other benzodiazepines are said to be the derivatives of are the metabolites of the chlorodiazepoxide. Like uh, one is the diazepam. The chemical name for the diazepam is the 7 chloro 1 methyl 5 phenyl 1 4 benzodiazepine 2 on. So to draw the chemical structure of benzodiazepine, first of all, you simply draw the basic ring nucleus of benzodiazepine. That is the benzene ring that you have to fuse with the seven member diazepine ring. And then you place the phenyl ring at the fifth number position. Okay, so for diazepam, the important functional group is that you have to place the methyl group at the first position. This one. Okay, this makes it that 7 chloro 1 methyl. That uh, uh, 1 methyl represents the presence of methyl group at the first position or at the well, first number. And the second position has the same ketone group. And uh, you may observe that the third position lack the any substitution or hydroxyl group. Beside this, it has the Chlorine at the seventh position. That is also the structural feature of many other benzodiazepine. Now let's learn about the chemical structure of nitrazepam. So the chemical structure of nitrazepam is similar to the diazepam, which we have discussed previously. Okay, the only difference is it do not have any methyl group at first position. Okay, you may observe that there is no any methyl group at first position. And beside this, in the place of chlorine, there is presence of nitro group at the seventh position. So this is the only difference between the chemical structure of diazepam and nitrazepam. So once you have understand the chemical structure of diazepam, all other benzodiazepine chemical structure will be easier for you. So in case of nitrazepam, what you have to do is you have to place the nitro atom or nitro group at the seventh position. And beside this, there is no any other substitution at the first position or third position. Clonazepam. The chemical structure of clonazepam is similar to the nitrazepam. Only difference is the presence of chlorine at the second number position of this phenyl ring. 
okay that is why the clonazepam is said to be the 2 chloro derivative of nitrazepam so what you have to do first draw the benzodiazepine ring nucleus that is the benzene ring fused with the diazepine one for diazepine ring and place the phenyl group at the fifth number position and then put the nitro group at the seventh position and second position ketone group and in case of clonazepam you have to place an additional chlorine at the second number position its chemical name for the clonazepam is the 7 nitro 5 2 chlorophenyl this represents that at the fifth position 2 chlorophenyl ring is present and 1 for benzodiazepine 2 on 1 for benzodiazepine 2 on 1 for basically represent the presence of 2 heteroatom that is the nitrogen at the 1 first and fourth position chlorazepate the chemical name for chlorazepate is the 7 chloro 2 oxo 5 phenyl 1 4 benzodiazepine 3 carboxylic acid you may observe that it in its chemical name that it has an additional functional group that is the carboxylic acid and that group is present at the third position this one okay so first you have to draw the ring nucleus for the benzodiazepine that is you have to first draw the benzene ring then make it fused with the diazepine one for diazepine ring and place the phenyl group at the fifth number position and the then place the same functional group that are the structure feature of all the benzodiazepine like uh, at second number position you have to place the carbonyl group and seventh position you have to place the chlorine and at third position in case of chlorazepate and other important structural feature is the presence of the carboxylic acid group so if you differentiate the structure of chlorazepate with the diazepam that uh, it only lacks the methyl group at the first position and it has an additional carboxylic acid at the third position. 3 hydroxy benzodiazepine. Now let's learn about the chemical structure of those benzodiazepine which have the hydroxyl group at the third position. The example are oxazepam, temazepam, and lorazepam so for drawing the chemical structure of these benzodiazepine first you have to draw the basic ring nucleus of benzodiazepine that benzene ring fused with the diazepine and place the phenyl ring at the fifth position now place a, the carbonyl group at the second position and seventh position will contain the chlorine and now at third position the common structural feature for oxazepam temazepam and lorazepam is the hydroxyl group okay so now let's learn about the structure of these three hydroxy benzodiazepine first one is the oxazepam the chemical name for oxazepam is the 7 chloro 3 hydroxy 5 phenyl 1 4 benzodiazepine 2 on this represents what that it contains the chlorine atom at seventh position three position have the hydroxyl group fifth position the same phenyl ring that is the structural feature of all the benzodiazepine and the two contain the same carbonyl group okay so this is the chemical structure for oxazepam oxazepam is differing from the what we say the chlorazepate is that it has the hydroxy group in place of the carboxylic acid at the third number position lorazepam lorazepam is basically said to be the two chloro derivative of oxazepam because it contains the additional chlorine at the second position of the 
phenyl ring that is present at the fifth position of diazepine okay so first you have to draw the structure of oxazepam in which you have to draw the ring nucleus of the benzodiazepine these three rings then place the hydroxy group at the third position ketone at second and chlorine at seven this will become the structure of oxazepam now you have to place only additional chlorine at the second number position of the phenyl ring the structure will become the chemical structure of the lorazepam the chemical name for lorazepam is the 7 chloro 3 hydroxy 7 chloro 3 hydroxy 2 chlorophenyl 2 chlorophenyl 1 4 benzodiazepine 2 on Timazepam. Timazepam is another important 3 hydroxy <coughs> substituted benzodiazepine. There are two important texts to remember the chemical structure of Timazepam. First one is that it is the 1 methyl substitution of the oxazepam. So if you have understand the chemical structure of oxazepam, you may observe the only difference in the chemical structure of timazepam is the presence of methyl group at the first position. So first you have to draw the chemical structure of oxazepam that is first you draw the chemical ring nucleus of benzodiazepine plus the ketone group at the second position and third position will have the hydroxyl group and seventh will have the chlorine. This will be the structure of the oxazepam. Now you have to place an additional methyl group at the first position. Now the structure will become the structure of Timazepam. Beside this, there is an other important trick that first you draw the chemical structure of Dizepam. Okay, so Dizepam chemical structure will be the first you have to draw the ring nucleus for benzodiazepine that is the benzene ring will be fused with the diazepine and then place the phenyl at the seventh position and place ketone at second and chlorine at seventh and methyl at the first okay now in the diazepam structure you have to place an additional hydroxyl group at the third position this one now the structure will become the chemical structure of timazepam so the important trick is if you remember the chemical structure of diazepam the other chemical structure will be easier for you to understand triazolo or imidazole benzodiazepine these are the certain types of the benzodiazepine which have the triazole ring or imidazole ring at the first second position the example are elprazolam triazolam, estazolam, and midazolam. Triazolo benzodiazepine. This is the general ring nucleus for the triazole benzodiazepine. Triazole is basically the five member heterocyclic ring that contain the two carbon atom and the three nitrogen. This one is the triazole ring that is present at the first and second position you may observe that it has the two carbon atom this is one and this is the second and the three nitrogen atom one two three so that is why it is said to be the triazole ring and this triazole ring in case of benzodiazepine is present at the first and second position this is the first and second position the example are estazolam triazolam and elprazolam this R1 and R2 represents the substitution site or the additional functional group which may be present or absent in these three triazole benzodiazepine. Elprazolam. Elprazolam is one of the triazole benzodiazepine derivative. The structure of elprazolam benzodiazepine contain the triazole ring at the first and second position of the diazepine ring nucleus of the benzodiazepine beside this it has an additional methyl group in the 
triazole ring of the benzodiazepine. This is the chemical structure of alprazolam. Triazolam. Triazolam is another example of triazole benzodiazepine. Its structure is similar to that of alprazolam. The only difference is it contains the additional chlorine group or the chlorine at the second number position of phenyl group phenyl ring that's why it is also known as 2 chloro or ortho chloro alprazolam because the chlorine is present at the ortho position of the phenyl ring in the triazolam structure triazolam is an ultra short acting benzodiazepine it can be metabolized by the hydroxylation at this methyl group and it is converted into the methanol. Same is in case of alprazolam. Midazolam. Midazolam is another important type of benzodiazepine. The chemical structure of midazolam benzodiazepine has an additional five-membered heterocyclic imidazole ring that is present between the first and second position of the benzodiazepine ring nucleus. This ring is the imidazole ring. Imidazole is basically the five-membered heterocyclic ring that contains the two nitrogen atom and three carbon atom. In case of midazolam chemical structure, imidazole ring has an additional methyl group present at the second position. Besides this, the chemical structure of midazolam also has an additional fluorine group or the halogen atom that is fluorine present at the second position of the phenyl ring. The triazole benzodiazepine and the Midazolam or imidazole benzodiazepine are usually ultra short acting or short acting benzodiazepine. They rapidly undergo through the metabolism at this ring site, heterocyclic ring site, and this methyl group undergo through the alpha hydroxylation. Beside this, the other type of benzodiazepine, like those which have the hydroxy group at the third position like oxazepam, timazepam and the lorazepam rapidly undergo through the glucuronide conjugation as they already have the hydroxy group at the third position which enhances the polarity of their chemical structure and due to which they have the shorter duration of action and they have the shorter half-life and beside this the benzodiazepine which lacks the hydroxyl group in their chemical structure are first undergo through the phase 1 oxidation reaction and once in the phase 1 reaction the polar functional group is imparted in their chemical structure and then they will undergo through the phase 2 reaction so we will learn in detail about the the metabolism of the each and every class of benzodiazepine in our upcoming lecture in which you will be able to learn about the different type of chemical reaction that are going to be take place in the different benzodiazepine so this was all about the chemical structure of different type of benzodiazepine I hope now all the benzodiazepine chemical structure will be easier for you thank you so much everyone allah bless you all